My man right here in the blue jacket, you see how hungry he is? Are you hungry? Yes. Okay, speak into the mic. Yes, let's go. Okay, that's, that's the way I want you to speak. Okay. Are you ready? Yep, let's do it. Okay, I sent in a credit application on a 2018 Ford Edge. You feel me? Yep. Cool. I like the vehicle. You call me, show it to your manager. He says, get him in, he's approved. Does that sound about right, guys? Get him in, he's approved. Okay? Call me. Hey, what, hi, can I speak to Andy? Yeah, what's going on, bud? Hey, what's up, Andy? Just wanted to let you know that we got a pre-approval on your loan, and we are ready for you to come down. Are you available today? Yeah, hey, man, number one, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Um, so what's my payment going to be? Oh, my gosh. I'm so glad you asked that, Andy. The payment is very important, I'm assuming. Um, just so you all know what my store does, we do something a little bit different. I'm going to kind of twist it to that. We do something a little bit different. What we do is we use, we, what we do is we use, what we use is called market-based pricing. So what that means is that we actually have... Hold on. Do me a favor. Take your hand and slap your ass. I don't even know what the fuck you're saying. Slow down. Remember how I just got done saying a minute ago, listen to me? You're ready to overcome something. Your words mean nothing if it doesn't match what I need. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. What's the objection? Your, what the payment is going to be. So why are you talking about price? Payment. What? Why am I talking about price instead of payment? Well, I asked you, what's my payment going to be? And then you started talking about, we use tools okay. um, and we use what's called market-based pricing. Yeah. It's not a price. Now, matter of fact, if anything, you've just made me wonder what's the price going to be also. Right? Yeah. Okay, now listen to me. I know this. You're a little bit nervous. Do you want to gather yourself? No, I'm okay. Okay, can you handle this? Yes. He's a lion. Let's go. Let's listen. go. <laughs> you know. Okay, now listen to me. Hey, guys, and if you want to understand this, that guy right there, he trusts me to grow him. Okay? Yes. So he has respect for this conversation we're having. I'm not fucking with him. I, I want him to have the life that he's told me he wanted. Now, since the last time I've seen him, he should be ready for this. This is easy. This is nothing for him. So now I need you to bury it, put it to bed. You got caught off guard, and I'm going to give you a chance to reset. Hey, call me. Call me. Let me know I'm approved, or let me know you got a way to go. Let's knock this shit out. We'll go through this. We'll take a quick break. We'll come back in. We'll kill it. Ready? Go. <laughs> Let's go. What's, hey, Andy. Um, good news. We got you pre-approved on the car that you like. Uh, when can you come in? Um, well, number one, hey, thank you so much. Um, what, what is my payment going to be? I'm so glad you asked that. That's a great question. Your payment's going to be... <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Hold on. Twins, who's responsible for him? Oh, What's <laughs> up? <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right, listen, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk to you in a minute yes. after Ian gets done having a talk with you. Okay? Okay, hold on. I'm going to let him go, and then we'll let Errol. Ready? I'm going to let you go. Earl was my first client that I trained. How are you going to just throw Earl out there like that? Hey, hold on. <laughs> you know? Uh, no, okay. no, listen. Listen, here's what we're going to do. It's Air. It's Errol. We're from Denver. Oral. That's how we speak in Denver. Hey, can you bury this? Yes. Okay. You see this little calm storm right here? Like, looks. He looks like a tornado F6 that's about to hit. It's quiet. Nobody knows what's going on. And then, bow! It's like everything's flattened. That's you. Okay. Ready? Hey, call me. Let me know that I'm approved. Let me know that you got a way to go. Whatever. Ready? Go. Hey, Andy, it's Roger over at Vans. I got a way to go. When can you get in? Hey, thank you so much. Really appreciate you. By the way, what's my payment going to be? Hey, I'm so glad you asked that. My licensed finance department has a very strict budgeting program to ensure that you don't ever have a payment that's too high. In fact, 95% of my clients, Andy, who have had the same concern as you in the past, left with a much lower payment than they were expecting. So I'm glad you asked that. I know you don't have to have that concern. What time can you make it in tonight? Good job. <laughs> Hey, hey, Earl, come here. Hey, uh, Andy, he's been training with me for eight months straight. Eight months. Hey, every listen, day, hold too. on. Luis I want to do there. this. Luis knows it too. Let's do this. 
Let's see. Luis needed that. Good, great, unstoppable. Am I right? Okay. Let, let's see if Earl can handle that better. Cool? Listen to me. It's not always about what you say. It's also about how you say it. Am I right? Is buying a car exciting? Okay. My man got deadly with the words, but is there another level of charisma we could have put on that? Cool. Let's see if Earl can bring that out and, and, and send us into our break. You ready? All right, Earl. Call me and let me know you got a way to go. Hey, Andy. It's Earl. Hey, we got you pre-approved in that vehicle. Oh, you got to speak into it. I know that we got a big guy here with the mic down like that. There we go. Okay, here we go. Ready, go. Hey, Andy. We got you pre-approved in that vehicle that you were looking at. When can you make it in? Cool. Hey, I really appreciate you. By the way, what's my payment going to be? Hey, Andy, I'm so glad you asked. Thank you so much. I just want to let you know we have a licensed finance department. It's phenomenal. They use a strict budgeting program to ensure you never have to worry about your payment being too high. In fact, 95% of my customers, 95% of them who've had that same concern in the past have left with a much lower payment than they were expecting. So I'm so glad you asked that. Getting to know you here on the phone, you never have to worry about that. Not only do we go beyond that, we also are highest in all the critical areas that are important to you and your family. When can you make it in? Good job. Hey, now listen. Hey, guys, I'm sorry. We get excited about large. this. You know what I like? You know what? There's nothing like... Look at it. I want you to think about something. There's nothing like being around people who want to win. There's nothing like it. I know some of you right now, you're trying to find that state because you say, well, this isn't the way we do things where I'm from. Whoa, you got it messed up, man. Do people want to be in a good mood to say yes? Yeah. Do they want to have a good attitude? Yes. Do you think with all this COVID that's happened out here that there's a lot of people running around with negative attitudes and negative mindsets? Can I ask you a question? When they met you on the phone or in person, did they expect to find a person who made their life better, who made them fired up to want to buy a car? That's the way they should feel. They didn't expect to find it, but they did, and they found it with you. This is an art. It's like professional football players getting paid hundreds of millions of dollars to play. They are the best in the freaking world. I'm going to explain this. When you're dealing with the elite, centimeters win. Energy on words will win. Energy on words. I want you to understand this. Your job is to make your customer feel a complete peace. Okay? What do people do? They move when they're at peace. What also is your job? To make people agree with you. You got to get people to agree. Look at the word track here. Just flip it on. And I want you to understand this, right? Every single person, when they said, what's my payment going to be? You'll notice we didn't say, I can't give you that. I don't know that. Uh, come in and we'll give it to you when you get here. No, man, you're turning me off. Okay? What do we say? The first thing is, I'm so glad you asked that. Okay? Everybody, listen to me. Customer asks you something. They have a concern. When you say and repeat back to them, hey, Mr. Customer, number one, I'm so glad you asked that. And you do that and they can feel that in your voice that you are not at all uncertain about this area. They feel certain with you. They know they've got the right person and they know they're going to get the right deal. And if you listen to what Earl said, he said, hey, I'm so glad you asked that. Our licensed finance department uses a very strict budgeting system that ensures that, look, you don't ever have to worry about your payment being too high. As a matter of fact, he said 95% of my customers, 95% that had the same concern as you right now in the past actually left with the much lower payment than they were expecting. So getting to know you here on the phone, we're phenomenal in that area. You don't have to have those concerns. What time can you make it in, tonight or tomorrow morning? And by the way, we're also going to treat you with world-class customer service. We're phenomenal in every area of the industry, so I'm great at that part. What color is your vehicle? That way I know it's you when you get here. What would you like to drink? You just start rolling right into that appointment. There's no concern. Nobody even feels like you're hiding something. Have you guys ever felt a salesman hide something on you? And the crazy shit is, you can tell they're hiding it. Is there anything that pisses you off more than that? I mean, honestly, like you guys can't be the people that are here training to leave and still hiding 